<laughs> no matter how you feel about nuclear power, one fact remains in this country, the, the way we store it and store waste. We basically have no idea what to do with nuclear waste, it seems, uh, that comes out of the nation's reactors. Dave Malkoff found what might be a solution at the MIT campus. Take a look. Smart is back. Truly the superpower of the atomic age. First, let's explain how nuclear power plants work. They're really just a fancy way of boiling water. Yeah, that's a good start. Boiling water spins turbines, making electricity for you. Similar to the natural gas plant that's out the window right there. Gas and coal plants give off carbon that warms the planet. Bad stuff. Nuclear plants create radioactive waste. Also bad stuff. It all starts out looking something like this. This is simulated nuclear fuel, the same size and shape. The reaction begins when you drop it into what's called a fuel rod. Place them next to each other and atoms start to split. Things get very hot, very fast. Even when you turn off the reaction, and even when the fuel is used up, it's still very hot for thousands of years. So when they pull the fuel out, there's still an enormous amount of energy that's left in it. That's what makes it so dangerous. Well, I'm Leslie Dewan, chief scientist of Transatomic Power. Now, Dr. Dewan's company believes that they have come up with a way to use all that extra energy. Think about it this way, thanks so much. <laughs> Think about the nuclear fuel as being a hot dog, a very, very hot dog, and the fuel rod in this case is the bun. After three or four years, the bun starts to degrade, you start to get ketchup and mustard on your hands, and it's becomes a bit of a problem. She believes she's found a way to get rid of that damaged bun, cut up the still good hot dog, and use that remaining heat. We have very low fuel costs because we're running on what is basically trash. That trash becomes carbon-free electricity, and there's plenty of radioactive trash just sitting around wherever you find a nuclear power plant. I've always considered myself to be an environmentalist. So what I feel we need to do is make nuclear a more attractive option than coal. Now, sure, there are safety questions here. That's why this is years away from the testing phase. But other countries and other companies are looking at doing this same thing. So this seems like a technology that is coming our way. Wow. <laughs> Visually, that was really cool. He, he liked yeah. that. He liked Smartest yeah, story of the smart. day, Dave Malkoff. That is. See, this almost seems like when we use our our landfills and we we harness the methane from that to run our turbines, we're basically using trash to make energy again. Yeah, it's it's stuff that they throw away that they don't have any idea what to do with. There was a plan to put this in a mountain in Nevada, but that got scrapped by the energy department. So all of the nuclear power plants that you see on that map, they all store the nuclear waste on site. So this is a way to put that into a salt awesome. and then just get power out of it. You'll only see stories like that right here on your Weather Channel. Thank you, Dave Malkoff. We'll be right back. That's incredible.